I am mega passionate about design and architecture. I am a realtor, I am the son of an architect, and I come from a family of builders. I am here to get you behind the fence. Guys, I am really excited today. We have a real banger. We have a brand new, completely remodeled, redesigned property by Zach and Jesse, local builders. Those guys are my guys. That's why I'm here. It is a modern farmhouse. Guys, it is a Baldwin Hills overlooking Beverly Hills, the Hollywood Hills, and you can even see downtown LA. You got to see the views. So how about we do that walk-in? So here's the, one of the features that I really love about the property. Right off the gate, you get the brand new cement, smooth cement blocks, the modern start fe uh, feel to the property. And at the same time, you also get the farm lights really nice accident feature for the property I feel like it's a good blend between the two you guys are gonna see how Zach and Jesse were able to retain some of the original pieces of the home but add that modern touch so let's go inside that was a great entrance but I am dying to see this view already I know the home is beautiful I want to see this view Let's go take a look at the view first. How awesome is this? It is a beautiful view. I am in love with this. Here's what I love about Baldwin Hills. Number one is a secret that most people don't know yet here in LA as places like West LA, Culver City, West Adams, they all, you know, they all really popular right now for buyers. I feel like Baldwin Hills is one of those hidden gems still. The views. So you get a, you know, basically a 160, 180 view of downtown LA all the way to the Hollywood Hills and Beverly Hills. For me, honestly, I feel like this is one of the best views in LA because you get to see the entire city from the reverse perspective, right? So you get to look at the other hills from this hill. I am really, really in love with this. I love the neighborhood, that neighborhood neighborhood feel. The people around here are extremely friendly. What's not the love? Cool, so how about we take a look at the house already, right? Let's start with the kitchen because I am loving the accents on the kitchen. We have black cabinets, which I love. Real, real modern feel with the gold accents all the way around and also that farmer style cabinets and shelving around as well. I like the fact that Zach and Jesse went straight up with the quartz. I thought that was a nice touch versus having tiles up here, which most people do. Personally, I like this look a little bit better because it's a lot smoother and cleaner and gives it that sleek feel. Also, the black trim around the windows to match the cabinets in the rest of the house. I thought that was a nice touch. They didn't have to do that and spend the money there, and they definitely did. Brand new state-of-the-art appliances are also in this home. Really nice touch. I also love the black sink that goes together with all the other black accents on the property. Really nice touch. And they kept the original fireplace, which is the dual fireplaces in the living room as well as the and the dining room slash kitchen. I am loving the fact that they kept the original piece of the property. They could have just gotten full modern with this and they didn't. What they did is they did add a brand new, uh, really nice cement color gray paint on this to make it a little bit more modern. Along with the extra large, you know, island that we have here, you can really have some friends over you can have your spread right here with amazing wines and enjoy this beautiful view. Also, another thing that I really love is the light fixtures and accents around the property. Uh, you have this really unique piece right here on top of the giant island, which I think is just the right size because what happens is when you have this giant island right here like this, you need a light fixture that matches that. And this does the job. And what they also did is I noticed 
they match the two small lights up there to go with this one, which I think is a really nice touch. Now, guys, let's go into the living room. This living room has the greatest freaking view ever. I could literally see downtown LA right here on my right, and I can see the Hollywood sign to my left. This is grand. This is truly grand, guys. I am loving how the farm style really comes into play here in the living room. You see the really thick board pieces for the hardwood floors, giving you that farm feel. Yet at the same time, I'm looking at the frame of the windows, I'm looking at the black accents, the gray cement, colored paint on the fireplace, and the natural wood pieces to go along with that, playing that contrast of modern and natural farm feel. Yet, I'm in one of the biggest cities in the country and looking at one of the best views in the country. This is truly amazing. So how about we take a look at that match the bedroom? Come on in guys. This is truly a small, cute and quaint retreat. The bedroom also has plenty of space though for a California king size bed. And you have access to the wonderful deck out there. This is truly, truly amazing. You can just chill out here, reading a book, ah, oh, relaxing. Let's look at that master suite. Oh, and we can't forget the awesome farm style out the door. These are becoming pretty popular, right? You have, again, the black accents everywhere with the tiles and the grout with the gold faucet and shower head. I'm loving that. Also loving the tub, extra large tub with the gold pieces and accents around. This is really nice. Uh, again, the property is a three bedroom, two bath home. And we'll take a look at those real quick. Bedroom number two, right here. And bedroom number three. Let's not forget that second bathroom. Now, this is not the entire house. I have a little secret to share with you guys. We have a second level to the home downstairs which is one of my favorites. So let's go through the dining room really quick and then we head downstairs. How about this? For me, as a small business owner, this will be pretty much the ideal home. I can get away from the house upstairs and I can come down here and work and still have the amazing view. Cool, so let's sit outside and let's talk about the features of the home real quick. How about that? So what do you guys think? I personally think this is one of the best homes I have seen in a long time and that's why I had to show up and see this property myself. There is no wonder whatsoever why this home sold so quickly. It was listed at 1.65 and it lasted only a week and a half on the market. Not surprised at all. It is a beautifully appointed home. Most importantly, it kept the original signature pieces of the home. The fireplace was just simply remastered and brought up to life. It made it modernized in a sense. And at the same time was given that farm, new farmhouse style feel to it, making it really different from all the white boxes, what we like to call them the business. I'm personally a 
local realtor here in LA and I see modern homes all the time. They're in dime a dozen. What I have not seen is a beautiful marriage between a farm style and a modern property here in LA. There are few out there. This is definitely one of the best that I've seen in many, many years. Now, things that I do, do love, those huge open uh, doors, dual doors coming up in the living room that you can enjoy as soon as you get home. The other thing is the access from the master suite over to that balcony as well. The kitchen, it is truly an entertainer's kitchen with that extra large quartz countertop right that smack in the middle with that giant island. And obviously the light fixture, that chandelier on top of it matches beautifully, especially with the two accent lights to go along with it. Jesse and Zach have done an amazing job rebuilding this thing. It took them, I believe, and I'm, if I'm not getting this wrong, it took them six months to bring this house back to life. It was basically a teardown, and they have done a beautiful job. So much so that you probably see in the footage that the lot right next to it is empty. Why? That property was actually taken down because it was no good. Some of these homes are really going down. And builders like Zach and Jesse are really reviving some of these properties. I am loving what they're doing here. I am loving this neighborhood. I just want to stay out here and enjoy the view. And I think I'm going to order me some, uh, some food. And uh, Eric and I, my cameraman, my brother, we're going to have a couple of drinks on that balcony. All right, guys. Until next time, see you here in LA.